time we're going to talk about how to add new field under report builder so in sql they have two field whereas fixed field another one is database field so from the screen here from the label until this part this will be a fixed field where if you didn't see this from your report you can go to view and go to toolbars and make sure standard component is tick so now uh, I will explain normally we will use label and rich text in a normal report so let's say label label is only for one row let's say I want to add a label call send to okay so I just fill it the words I wish to add on and make it move the place that I wish to add and for rich text it's more than one line so you can go to rich text here maybe I want to place it under the footer so I right click and go edit and just type it whatever I wish to add on so this is something like words also you can make it bold, underline or italic is up to you and you can change the font size too so after done you can just close it and click on yes the second field is database field where it's so called changing field for example like company name whenever in the invoice I change to another customer so the company name will change too so normally Changing field, we're using DB text or DB rich text to present in the report. So, like example, DB text. Okay, so we add on. Uh, maybe I have a agent. So, I make sure I call the DB text already. And under the parameter, make sure I'm choosing the correct parameter. And I assign as agent. And for the footer part maybe I need to add on a, a not okay then I call out db rich text under here and go to main and you select the note and the same idea for the more description where you can come to sub -nome document detail and come from here and you can map in your document detail and description tree so this is using for more than one line and also there's a features for db rich text also where you can right click and you can do it as stretch or shift relative to okay let's see now description have more than one line and after description i want to show more description but i cannot be as back every single line is the same length so i make it as description as a db memo and more description as a db rich text so after description so i want you to right click on the db rich text where more description come to shift relative to and switching after description there will be show with more description subsequently so this is the usage for shift relative to in future maybe you want to invisible some field maybe like discount you don't want to show under the report you can highlight it and right click and go to invisible so this is how we hiding up and also under unit price if you do don't want to show when it is zero, you don't want to show. Okay, you can highlight and right click on it and make sure you have tick blank when zero. The same too for the quantity. And we also can set the display format for unit price. Let's say I want the unit price have three decimal. Then I can right click, go to display format and set the display format like this example. And press OK. So after done everything, then you can go to File and Save as as a new report, or you can save to replace the original one. 
So look at here. This is the sample where just now I had add the label send to and my agent. And just now I had hidden up the discount and also the footer. So this is how you add the fill. We can also add line under the report builder. So for example, I come to line here and I highlight here. I can make it longer or if I want it to be vertical line, then under here, make it as left, then it can be a vertical line. So this is how you make it as a horizontal or a vertical line in SQL. And the same thing too, we can add a shape like uh, I want to add a rectangle okay, or you can choose either by square, by ellipse, by circle, it's up to you. So this is how you created your shape and so on. We can add also some logo or picture in report. So how to add in? Then we can come to the picture here image click on it maybe i under the footer load a photo so i can right click on the image and go picture and i can select the logo example iso open and you can oh it's too big and you can right click on it make it as stretch so it will fix on the square box that you have fixed the size so after done, just save it. Nevertheless, there's also variable can be add on. So what is variable? Actually, this is something like calculation that will write some simple query and system will calculate it. For example, um, you can see the screen here, like the variable amount here is all using the variable function. You can right click and go calculation and you can see this is all the query updated here. And there are also we need to mention our page number then we can use a system variable. So we come to here system variable and call it up put maybe put under the footer uh yeah so the System variable is up to you. You can choose many type of here. Page set, pass it, description. Okay, so after done and just save it.